What's your own sense? Would you go for a diversified electronics business model like Samsung at this stage or pure play, TMC, to, pure play chips model like TSMC because of obviously the NVIDIA euphoria? Yes, thanks for having the opportunity to discuss and compare TSMC to Samsung. We have a, a positive or buy rating on both. And we're going to uh, compare the two on a relative performance. Um, obviously, uh, TSMC it has a better um, uh, quality of earnings. We upgraded TSMC a, a month ago due to the fact that inventory correction among TSMC's customers would uh, come to an end by uh, middle of this year. And TSMC will also benefit from the ramp up of new products such as NVIDIA's um, H100 and AMD's Genoa and, and Intel's uh, um, Meteor Lake. I think what investors need to better understand is the fact that TSMC offers lower volatility than earning, primarily due to, due to the fact that TSMC dominates in what they do. Samsung, as you highlighted, is more diversified, but they're more susceptible to um, the changes in the global macro environment, Samsung has more leverage to memory industry, which is more volatile compared to TSMC that has uh, more leverage to leading edge semiconductor manufacturing. So on a relative basis, I think TSMC offers better quality of earning and also a much better free cash flow margin to, compared to Samsung Electronics. Indeed, uh, Mehdi, but I think what's uh, really being an overhang for TSMC currently right now, aside of valuations, aside of uh, the fundamentals, uh, which of course have been compelling, and this is a secular growth story, a compounding one for investors, is geopolitics, right? And so just, you know, the tensions around Taiwan Strait, uh, TSMC being caught in the crosshairs of U.S.-China tensions, uh, uh, is making investors like Mr. Warren Buffett a bit wary. And so wouldn't you kind yes. of step back a bit from that perspective and look at something like Samsung at this stage because it's, it's just clear off from, uh, and it's steering clear off uh, all the geopolitics out there. It's in region-wise, geographically. Yes, I think there's a very important topic to highlight here and a great question. What you need to know and what investors need to know, there are alternatives to Samsung. When it comes to memory, there are a number of memory manufacturers like SK Hynix and, and Micron. But when it comes to leading edge semiconductor manufacturing, it's pretty much Taiwan Semi. So if in a scenario where there is increased geopolitical tension, I don't think Apple, Nvidia, AMD, Amazon, Google, Microsoft would have a second choice. Samsung has been trying to catch up in foundry, specifically leading edge foundry, but they're still way behind TSMC. So if there is increased geopolitical tension, I think we got a bigger issue. If, 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 if Nvidia shares were up 20 some percent plus today, and if there is an increased geopolitical issue, Nvidia has no choice. NVIDIA is relying on TSMC, and if TSMC is impacted by geopolitical uh, conflict, their customers would be more impacted than TSMC.